President Ferdinand Marcos Jr. and Japanese Prime Minister Fumio Kishida affirmed their commitment to resolve maritime conflicts through peaceful negotiations. The Philippines and Japan have entered into a bilateral defense pact that will allow the sharing of military training and operations between troops of both sides as Japanese Prime Minister Fumio Kishida cited a complex international situation during his visit to Manila. In a joint statement with President Marcos after their bilateral meeting Friday night, Kishida announced that a decision was made by them to start negotiations of a Reciprocal Access Agreement RAA. RAA is a defense and security agreement between Japan and a partner country to share military training and operations. It will also create a framework for both sides to move their troops whenever required as well as an avenue for goods to be imported and exported from one country to the other through following the movement of visiting military. The Philippines is the third country with which Japan entered into such an agreement. The others are Australia and the United Kingdom. During his talk with Marcos, Kishida said he had with his Filipino counterpart an open-minded discussion on bilateral cooperation and responses to various regional and international issues, which allowed them to confirm that there is a steady progress in the relations of both sides. The Japanese leaders said Tokyo and Manila are deepening their security relations due to increasingly severe and complex international situation. That's why he said, I'm happy that we are able to agree on the provision of a coastal surveillance radar to the Philippines as the first project under the newly launched Official Security Assistance, OSA, this year. Japan is one of the countries vocal in its support for the Philippines and fight for sovereignty over the West Philippine Sea. Kishida said both countries also agreed to promote ties to improve the Philippines' maritime law enforcement capabilities through Tokyo's provision to Manila of patrol vessels and defense equipment and the advancement of technology cooperation through transfer of warning and control radar systems. Kishida also assured the Philippines that Japan will continue with its public-private support for infrastructure development in line with President Marcos's Build Better More policy. And also decision was made to provide heavy equipment for disaster management to help peace and economic and social development in the Mindanao region, he said. In addition, we will continue to cooperate in areas such as smart agriculture, decarbonization and energy transition and tourism, he added. Kishida landed in Manila on Friday for a series of activities in Manila, including a sit-down with Marcos and a speech between a joint session of the Congress.